Today something very exciting happens, which is the launch of my very small scale upcycled line of swoverels. Now if you don't know what swoverels are, they are sustainably produced overalls made from sweat pant material, and yes, they are amazingly comfortable. So swoverels had some damaged pairs on hand, and they came to me with the idea that I could kind of repair and upcycle those pairs to save them from the landfill, which I've done, and now you guys have the chance to purchase and the most exciting exciting part is that 25% of every purchase is going to go to the National Police Accountability Project and I'm just so stoked about it. So this is a very, very small scale little collaboration. You know, Swoverall's is a small company and I'm only one person. So right now there's only 13 pairs available, but excitingly enough, there are some other damaged pairs that I have yet to repair. I honestly can't tell you guys how excited I am about this little project. Um, I'm super obsessed with all of the pairs that I've upcycled and we're just doing good things and I'm so proud of, of all of it. So I wanted to bring you along and show you how I'm repairing some of these pairs and how I'm upcycling some of these pairs because that's what I'm all about. So let's go. So the damages on these 12 rails were either one of two things. One was the top closures where it hooks into kind of the snap. Those were either kind of broken off or the side snaps were kind of falling apart a little bit. So my solution to the top problem was using a method that I've actually already used um, in a video that I've made on YouTube. I took a pair of linen pants that I thrifted and turned them into overalls. I made buttonholes and just kind of loop the strap through. So that's what I did with the swove rolls. So let me show you how I repair the top button part. For the side snap problem, I just kind of sewed them all the way shut and I'll show you how I do that as well. Here's the super fun part. What came along with some of those damaged overalls were discontinued overalls that have some fun colors. They gave them to me to upcycle and so I have a few left to do and I wanted to bring you along as I added some really cool fun flair to those pairs. Okay, I gotta say I'm really excited about all of the pairs that I'm upcycling, but this pair I'm super excited about. So I'm taking the this light blue kind of tealish swoveralls and I'm going to be adding some little lemons with fabric and some little green leaves all over them. It's going to be so cute.
been lifted by you. And it's love we have to share. My life's been troubled and it's been so hard. I've been down and out so long till now. You help me find me to show me the Okay, now this next pair is so stinking cute. They're this really light pink peachy color. And my idea is to put a little bit of flowers popping out of the pockets. They're not damaged up here with the hardware, but I kind of wanted to remove that and put in a buttonhole and a tie to make it a little bit more girly, I guess, I don't know. I just really like a look of a tie kind of hanging down. I think that would look really cute on this pair. that I've done. I've done 13 total, so I wanted to give you a sneak preview of some of the other pairs that I did. Sit on my bed, I got nothing to do. Take on my phone and stick it right to you. I'm really bored. Please don't ignore. Started as fun, though I randomly know. You love rainy days and you still live at home. It's cool to see. You're real with me. Straight to your face Thank you guys so much for watching. Go check out the website if you want to. And thank you so much for supporting me and making this possible. It's just, it's such a big deal to me. And I know that there's only 13 pairs and I'm sorry about that. That's really not a lot, I know. But I we do plan to come out with a few more in the future, so stay tuned if you're interested. And thanks again for watching, and I hope to see you in my next video. Bye guys.